Hello Internet, my name is Josh and uh, as you can tell by the title of this video, this is my ultimate 7 superheroes or my super 7 as Lily Juice, the person who tagged me, uh, named hers. Now first off, let me say that I'm not particularly good at like vlogging or talking about something while not playing a game so please bear with me if I fumble my words or say something wrong and go blah 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 because I tend to do that. And I actually wrote that intro down. Uh, something I rarely do. I didn't write this part down, but you know, I just want to make that <laughs> make that clear that I'm not very good at this. So to start off, I'm gonna go from my absolute all-time favorite to like superhero or character to my like not least favorite, but you know, like it's not that it's still one of my favorite characters and stuff, but it's not you know absolute mother like start off number one right at the top you know that's that's who i'm gonna start off with <laughs> okay first off we have uh batman now the reason i don't know why i really like batman a lot maybe it's because he's just a normal dude well not really normal dude he's uh unbelievably rich and stuff but like like he's if he wasn't rich he'd be a normal dude no wait no that did it that doesn't really make i'm sorry don't listen to that part Batman. <laughs> Batman is my all-time favorite superhero. Now he, he might not have superpowers, but he has money, and he will throw that at your face, and you would die from that. But he doesn't kill people, which is another cool thing about him. Like he—he he, not only is he super rich and has like amazing gadgets and stuff, but uh, he's—he doesn't kill anybody because. He he's like ah I'm I'm not a I'm not a murderer you know like the guy who murdered his parents and yeah his parents are dead he has no parents but but a weird thing about Batman is that he takes in children and stuff I mean I I know he was an orphan too but it's kind of weird you gonna take children in and say fight crime with them they could potentially die like what one of them did but yeah Batman is my all time super duper unbelievably like favorite hero okay next off is commander shepard from the mass effect trilogy oh i should have said that batman from the dc universe but whatever you know that oh, how can you not know that but yeah commander shepard from the mass effect universe now i'll be honest the last game of course gotta bring up the last game's ending uh you know it wasn't great but don't diminish the game just because the ending wasn't great the whole the rest of the game was unfucking believable sorry i just swore right there but yeah that game that game series i just uh, second to batman of course is my favorite like current gen mass effect series is my favorite series of all time and um kind of shepherd uh well my shepherd this is not a picture of my shepherd obviously that's the stock shepherd but man I, I can't even explain it commander shepherd he's he saved the galaxy from the reapers when everybody was talking shit about him and everybody was saying no reapers don't exist fuck you he was like no fuck you reapers exist i'm gonna kill him and watch all your faces be like oh shit he was right yeah that's what the fuck happened and he fucking won no matter which ending you picked sorry spoiler alert i should have said that before my bad but yeah Commander Shepard, savior of the universe, and, you know, conqueror of evil and all that jazz. Okay, third, third on my list is, um, Sora from Kingdom Hearts. Now, let me make this clear. Sora is from, uh, the Square universe, not Disney, because my, my next, uh, person is from Disney, so I just want to make that clear right now that... I'm considering Sora a part of the uh, Square Enix universe and all that, so he's lumped in with Final Fantasy and all that and whatnot. But Sora, he, I don't know, he 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 was always cool. I I played the Kingdom Hearts series um, when I was I want to say I forget when it came out. I think it came out Kingdom Hearts. When, was, when, was, when did the first Kingdom Hearts come out? I know it was. Uh, wait, uh, I think it was like 11. Or 12? I'm not sure. I forget. Whatever it came out. Yeah, whatever. But that was my, f like, favorite game. Favorite, favorite, favorite game. Uh, Kingdom Hearts. O mostly because it was Disney. 
but then you got a keyblade keyblade is like the coolest weapon to me like oh my god this is probably like a terrible reason to like a character but holy shit the keyblade like I, I i i wanted one back then and i still want one to this day like i still play kingdom hearts i used to live i let i live streamed um the first kingdom hearts and beat it i still haven't finished the second one by the time of this video going out but still I, I i really i really love the kingdom hearts uh uh series and hopefully the third one comes out soon because i'm kind of getting tired of this bullshit all these fucking spin-off games that kind of like are kind of sequels but they're not you know like mostly most of them are prequels and then only one of them was like a sequel i don't know i but yeah sora from kingdom hearts so <laughs> sorry i just rambled on about stuff so my next character is hercules from disney from the disney movie hercules and the tv show and uh the reason i picked him is because uh i think hercules is one of the first disney movies I ever watched and I really remember like a lot and uh, always like Hercules got me into uh, Greek Greek mythology this movie right here and um, and uh, I just liked him mostly because he had super strength and he could you know punch people <laughs> that, was, that was really my main reason for liking him when I was younger but uh, yeah he he Hercules yeah what is that number four number five number four number four i think it was number four yeah so next person is team gohan like uh from dragon ball z the dragon ball z universe um what can i say about team gohan team gohan and i mean team gohan like cell saga team gohan and uh like he 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 was the nicest kid ever you know he didn't want to fight but you know when cell stepped on android 16's head Android 16, right? I think so. I think so. Android 16's head and murdered his his friend. He murdered his friend. Even though he's an android and not a real person, but still, that was Tingohan's friend. He went crazy and started murdering all of the so like he was he was he wanted peace and all of that. But turned out to be he like <laughs> killed the most people ever. Not not most people ever, but you know, of one of the good guys. He 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 was terrifying you know when you pissed him off like he's the hulk of the dragon ball z universe because he's nice you know he's a smart kid and all that and he listens to his mom and stuff but then when you piss him off he will murder you especially with one-handed super command male with the help of his you know uh, spiritual spiritual help of his dad and stuff but yeah team gohan is my fifth one i think <laughs> now my sixth favorite character is Finn from Adventure Time. Now the reason I picked Finn is because he's basically the kid that everybody thought or wanted to be when they were younger. Because he's just fighting monsters and saving people and stuff. Like every every kid felt like that, you know? But he's actually doing that, even though he's a fictional character on a TV show on Cartoon Network. That that, that that don't mean nothing he's he's real enough you know to be my top favorite person all of these people are imagine not imaginary but you know not real people but still like finn yeah he's just finn is fun basically and he can he can kick ass too <laughs> so next person is gara from naruto now i'm picking gara from for instead of naruto you know Mostly because Garo started off as a bad guy, then turned into a good guy, which I thought was really cool. Like, you know, like how Sasuke turned from a good guy, well, a dick good guy, to like a bad guy, a dick bad guy. But Garo, I liked him because, um, and I haven't really caught up with Naruto Shippuden, so I don't know what happens in the, spoiler alert, I don't know pfft, if you even care, but the, 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 what fourth ninja war i forget i'm sorry yeah i still haven't caught up to that shit yet but the reason i like goro is because mainly because he was a bad guy turned good and that all he wants to do is help people now instead of you know wanting to kill them like he used to which i thought was pretty cool so yeah that that ended off kind of poopy i'm sorry about that 
Uh, I'm not very good at this, as I said in the beginning. But yeah, those were my Super 7. And I know you're supposed to tag people, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just probably going to tag um, Lilikoi's channel and the video where she tagged me in. So yeah, thank you guys for listening to this, listening to me talk and ramble on about the uh, characters from, uh, you know, media. And, um, yeah, thank you so very much for listening. I don't know if I'm going to have a video going in the background. Probably some gameplay of a game going on in the background. But, yeah, whatever game it is, I'm playing that that game. Thanks for watching that, too. <laughs> and, um, uh, thank you, guys. Uh, remember to... S I'm saying thank you a lot. I'm sorry. I th this is how I always end things. I don't know how to end things. That's why. But, yeah, remember to uh, check out Lilikoi's channel. And, um... I'm sure most of you know who that is, <laughs> but thank you so very much for watching, and bye-bye for now.